You know what, Munoz? You're right. You're right. I should be talking about the, uh, this head-ass matchup from the, uh, these two knuckleheads. You got me to do it. Here we go. Game two, best of five, helpers up. John was looking for uh, a, a three-stock playing uh, from a deficit. I think it's really funny that Sonic Adventure 1 is, is playing. Uh, bro, how do you commentate this, man? Like, especially in, like, my position. <laughs> I, I really, like, I've wanted to, for a long time, to put, like, an input visualizer on stream. Uh, and, like, 
seeing Helper do it, you'd probably see like all the buttons lit up at all times. It'd probably be dark uh, less often. Oh yeah. Well, yeah. No, you would. Yeah, you'd, you'd see that A is B and B is A, which is fucking really crazy. All right, Helper taking the first stock. Uh, let, all right. Bro, is <laughs> Helper? Why did you do that so close? Uh, here come the head shakes. Oh my God. John can really can really see himself running on the side of that building in SA1. He's about to fight chaos, bro. Helper's game plan is chaos. Let's be real. Pete, bro. A is B and B is A. That's it. But like, what? No, he doesn't. No. Did he? Is A jump now? Wait, has it evolved? No, I don't believe you. I don't want to believe that. Helper took the first stock. He took the... And then John took the... I don't want to believe that the A button is now A to jump. <laughs> no! Hard to, to, to tone that tummy or some shit, bro. It was a two stock? Yeah, it was. Yeah, so Hover took the first stock and then the next three just went to John. Yeah, sorry, I was too far in the past of like the Brawl days. And like early Smash 4, it was definitely obviously like. You know what? What carried over from Brawl? I did not know. You know this sounds vaguely familiar to me. God damn it, man. Bro, Helper better have the cleanest IDJs with the jump button being that big. I should I should talk about the match, but I don't know. that S match for, bro. Oh, yo, can uh, can someone... I need to add a, a Sora command that explains that Sora is actually just floaty magic Falco. Everything is safe. And when he hits you, he puts you in a movie. I think the uh, the definition of helper season changed, and now we're hunting helpers, and that's what's going on. Yeah, and you're and yeah, it's just like he plays well, and then like if he gets frustrated, so this is why it's so hard to get a read on a player like helper because you just it's hard to get uh, an idea of like where we are. Oh my god, guys. Guys, the stage is over there. Oh my lord. Watch your posture. Keep those boots tucked in. Win or lose, someone's gonna be upset.
Oh my god. What? Okay. <laughs> no, we're gonna restart this whole thing. Boom, tech, ball, bounces off the stage. Yeah, and they just disconnects, yeah. My god. Uh, it's 2 1 now, yeah. Alright, let me actually try and commentate. I don't, uh, like, I, it's hard when I, when, like, when I know these players too well. Like, they're my friends, so I just want to shit talk them. I really just want to shit talk them, both. Also, I was playing John. I was playing Helper earlier today. He's making me OD tight. I'm just like, bro, this character is swinging, bro. Okay, Helper again with the edge guard. Ooh, nice. Er, almost gets the kill. Goes a little bit deep. I like that. Uh, but John able to avoid it, staying really high with the air stall. All right, John. Now with a bit of an edge guard situation. Helper trying to reverse it with the ice. Gets him to do a dodge, a block, and then, you know, able to get through with the Sonic Blade. Now we got another potential edge guard situation. Nice. Uh, not enough to, for the kill. Even though, like, what, 140 after hit? That's kind of OD. Flying around. Who's going to take center? No one's going to take center. They both literally ran away from center. Ah! Okay. John takes the grab. All right, what's going to happen here? Yeah, we're going to lose the stock, and it's going to be beamed by the soccer ball. All right, here we go. Now, if John is able to attack on some extra damage, you know, John's going to be really hard to play from behind just because, like, uh, you know, John's defensive play style. So now you're going to have to do something to get in. And, like, Honestly, like, both of these characters have, like, a similar... Like, they're in that same vein of, like, approaches where they want you to come to them. They can't be, like, super aggressive. Although, uh, Sora is going to have, like, a pretty okay time of, like, closing in and, like, kind of, like, making things a little bit claustrophobic because he's just got a billion things going on. Uh, but, you know, John is crafty. That's going to be the stop. Up B reaching from all the way across the stage. Not, not, not really though. But, but let's be real. Okay, here come all the spells. And all right, able to get something going, but Helper uh, didn't anticipate John going as low as he did, and so was able to make it around uh, going under. And now we both make it back to the stage. All right. John in an edge guard situation. Oh my god. <laughs> this character, man. Oh god. All right, John takes the second stock. This might be the set. Uh, oh, that's it. I <laughs> Watch your posture. Keep those boots tucked in. <laughs> I, I, oh my god. <laughs> oh no. 